Hey guys, long time no see. Welcome to Tech Tuesday. Let's just hop into it. Today we're going to be talking about the Corsair RM750E power supply PSU. Uh, not the most sexy of topics, but one of the most necessary for your computer. This one cost me 100 and I bought it not because I needed one, except for the fact I did need one. Uh, I was cooking some Mongolian beef the other day, and then I just saw a flicker of light. It was just like, Pachet! and I was like, oh, whatever. And then, uh, yeah, realized my computer blew a fuse, and the power supply went out. So went to Best Buy. The Best Buy was open for like 30 more minutes, and this seemed like the best deal. I was searching for new power supplies because I, I was pushing the limits on that one, um, but... I didn't expect to have to like emergency get one. Um, so I got this one from Best Buy. This was like one of the top ones. I was between a 750 and an 850, but here's a 750. Again, it was 999. What do you get out of this box? You see this box? Let me, let me show you. Okay. So inside this box, I, um, I didn't actually film the unboxing experience guys. I'm so sorry. Uh, let me open it up. And it sits right in there, and there's some extra stuff, some extra cords um, that I don't necessarily need. All I needed was the motherboard cord, the um, two SATAs for my SSDs and hard drives, and then I needed um, the CPU power and the GPU. And my new GPU only has one, uh, <laughs> one, uh, what? 8-pin. This has really good reviews. If you are on this video, you're probably looking at it. I've had it for about a month and a half now, and I have no issues. One of the cool features about this one is it's fully module, right? We need to say, hey, you don't need fully module. Still, you don't need it. I, I, I bought my other one semi-module a while ago. If you want to go check out that video, that video is six years old now. Uh, but this this is great, right? This is 80 plus gold, which the gold standard really just means that it's efficient at a certain rating. And if you look at the back here on the box, it actually has this lovely um, uh, curve of like efficiency. Um, and so to get that 80 plus gold, you have to maintain a certain level at a couple different spots. Uh, platinum's a little bit better. All it really means is that the power is coming out of the wall, is getting transformed into electricity for your computer and not fully into heat so like 85 percent it's only losing 15 percent of the power through the power supply which is very efficient especially in comparison to everything else in the past uh point is a couple other features of this lovely thing it has some cybernetic uh ratings for like platinum and standard which is m mid it's very mid on the cybernetics uh because you can get up to like diamond um above platinum is also titanium so it's very mid um, but zero RPM mode on here. It's a seven-year warranty, which uh, I really wanted to get something like that. It doesn't have Japanese capacitors, um, so if you're looking for that specifically, this is not where you're going to go for. Um, but other than that, it's it's a pretty it's a pretty good standard CPU. Um, you must if you're if you're buying this. Just a few tips for PSU stuff, right? Make sure. Again, that, that efficiency is going to hit around the median point of power. So 750, you're looking at, what, 350, 375 right there. Um, so how many wattage, right? So 375, if your computer's rocking around 400 with the 750, then you're going to be more efficient than others. And you still have some wiggle room if you need to add some more stuff on there. Um, so just be aware of what you need. Um, don't go too low on the the wattage don't go too high on the wattage because again efficiency really plays a matter you don't want to be chilling at like 30 percent efficiency if you went and got yourself like a 1200 watt like uh 1200 watt psu so just keep that all in mind other than that this video is fucking boring as shit guys thank you for watching i do recommend it a lot of reviews out there really recommend it just make sure you get something with a warranty from a good company corsair is pretty great um, and soon I'll have a video out on maybe signs that your PSU is failing uh, because I need to <laughs> I need to do that. But uh, between school and work and everything else, my life is very busy. So I'm sorry about not getting these videos out. But I appreciate you if you're watching it to this far um, through this length of this video. Thank you. If you subscribed, thank you. Uh, we're almost at 500 subscribers, which is amazing. Uh, 
we'll just keep on pushing through and uh, maybe not every week, maybe every couple of weeks, maybe twice a week. I'm going to put out as many videos as I can, but again, just going through life, you know how it goes. So thanks for watching. Um, love you.